guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Beige. If you are new here, welcome. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and comment down below before you leave. So today's video, I'll be trying on this beautiful wig that I picked up from Free Trust Equal. This is from their new Natural Me collection and basically their Natural Me collection is supposed to feature a variety of hairstyles and colors and the hair texture is supposed to blend in with African-American hair when it has been blown out and fully styled. So the wig that I picked up is in the style Natural Rod Set 1 inch and I did get this wig in a color number 1. This is their full cap drawstring wig. So basically it's a full cap wig with no type of parting space at all. The whole idea of this full cap half wig is so that I can have my hair on the front and that my hair blends in with the wig so that you won't be able to tell that it is a wig at all. Um, my hair is not out and my hair is in cornrows so I will be styling this wig without doing any type of parting and without my hair being out in the front. So this wig is made out of a drawstring construction so you are able to wear it as a ponytail as well if you decide not to wear it as a full wig. Let's jump right into this video. This is a really good fit for this not to be a full wig. So this wig does fit bigger head sizes. What do you guys think? I'm really scared to open my eyes right now. What do you think? Is she Sunday church ready? What what what's she giving you right now? Comment down below. Ooh, she is definitely definitely Sunday church ready for sure, honey. Honey, she's giving me Shirley Temple. She is giving me something. <laughs> Although I love the fact that she's curly, I don't like how perfect the curls are. And if I did do this to my own natural hair, I would separate the curls. So that's what I'm going to do now. Just making sure that it's in the middle. So I'm going to do one side separating and then I'm going to leave this side as it is. And I'm going to let you guys compare or tell me which side you prefer. This texture, it feels natural even. That's crazy, it feels like my own natural hair. So here's Miss Shirley Temple straight out of the package. And here we are with some life given to her. So I'm just going to pick through this side like I did this side and I'll come right back. Oh my gosh. I think I'm in love. I think I'm in love. Again, this is reminding me so much of like Tracy Ellis Ross's hair. Like my hair would get like this, but it's not this full. And this is so beautiful. This is so pretty. Like even if I got my scissors and cut it into like a full mushroom, this is so bomb. Obviously, I'm gonna have to like finger comb through the whole thing. What do you think about this? I love it. This is like so like 80s mom. <laughs> like this is giving me everything I want in a twist out. I'm gonna have to really cut the front because honey, the, it's just a little bit too long. So I'm gonna cut that. But look y'all, look at her. I don't know what type of cut they gave this wig because it's shorter in the back and like extremely long in the front. Don't know about that. So I may have to just grab my scissors and give it more of a shape. But so far, I am literally obsessed. And if you had your hair out in the front, you could even do like a half up, half down hairstyle. That would be super dope. Hey, sad parts. Hey, sad part. Obviously, if I had my hair out, it would look a lot better. This is super cute. Oh my gosh, I love her. I love it. I know what this hair reminds me of now. If I was to blow dry my hair and then do Bantu knots, it will come out looking like this. So that's the exact spitting image 
of how my hair would look in that hairstyle. If you want to give your hair a break, I think this wig is super inexpensive and it looks so natural that you can definitely get away with wearing it and nobody would know that it's not your hair. And I think that, you know, especially because we're in the winter months with the harsh weather, it's good to give your hair a break and just to grab something like this that's so believable would be such a great option to have. I will definitely be trying out more wigs from this line. So I just noticed that this side of the wig is longer than this side and it is perfectly in the middle of my head where it's supposed to be. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what type of hair shape it's supposed to be with this being longer, the front being long, and then this being really short. Maybe I just got a bad batch of the wig, but look, that's the difference in length. Crazy, right? Um, obviously, it wouldn't be that much of a deal. All I would have to do is just cut this to be the same length. So we're going to mess around with it now and see what I come up with. So I'm going to cut like some of this in the front. Okay. Okay, ma'am. I see you over here. We make this the same length. Do we have a look? Do we have a look? Shorty doo-wop. She's really doing it for me though. This is everything. I love it. I love it. Y'all know when I start singing, I love my, love my little wigs. Or if this video is longer than it's supposed to be, that means I love it too. I'm loving you. I'm gonna keep this wig forever and ever and ever. Be honest. If you see me just walking down the street, what would you say? Would you say, that's a wig on her head? Would you nudge your friend like that? Or would you say, is that her hair? Her hair is bomb. What would you say? I know I'll be like, dang, she has some beautiful hair. Obsessed. Hashtag obsessed, because that's the honest truth about this wig. I should have tried this on like a chocolate brown. I think that would have been so, so, so cute. What other colors do they have this in? I may have to cut a little bit more off, but this is so fucking long. Like, oh my gosh, love it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below as well as leave a comment down below. And I can't wait to see you all in my next video. Bye guys. It's Yeah, that's right. It's